a couple of freshmen. Charlie Reddy gets his first collegiate goal, but back up a couple of dependable goal scorers for BU this year, Colby. It's Brown's eighth and Hudson's sixth. Yeah, they've got depth. And that's one thing I think BU has a little bit more than DC this year. When you look at their scoring, spread out, it's pretty even amongst the lineup. We mentioned no Ryan Green tonight, who is probably the most skilled and best forward for the BU Terriers. So it is certainly going to take a committee for this hockey game. Lane Hudson joins us now. Lane, can you hear us? Hello, Lane. John Butchergoss and Colby Cohen with you. Uh, so how was your first 20 minutes of the BCBU game? Looks like Lane's on it. Can you hear us, Lane? I think we're having a little bit of technical difficulties. He's, right. uh, Lane is down there. And okay, we'll try to fix that. And uh, looking forward to talking to Lane. Yeah, I, I was going to ask him, did you feel a little bit a little extra nervous yeah. for this game. I remember my first BC game, Butch, and I think back to extra sets of butterflies in my stomach, a little extra jittery for the first couple of face-offs until Nathan Gerby ran me over, and then I felt <laughs> I was right at home in a hockey game. Yeah, that's it off to a great start. The freshman, 17 points in his 14 games coming into tonight. Six goals, 11 assists, the second-round pick of the Montreal Canadiens. Many thought he'd be a late first-rounder, um, but for whatever reason, he slipped to the second, and a Marty St. Louis, he's a small, skilled oh, yeah. little guy. I'll make that work. Oh, Hudson's going to play in the NHL. I mean, his skill set is just so unique, and his coaches, they told us, he's like a point guard. You know, you don't see that a lot in hockey, a guy who can really make other people miss, a guy who has such poise on the blue line. That's what Lane Hudson is. Well, it's Jerry York's night, honored tonight here at BC. The amazing titles, the amazing resume. Ladies and gentlemen, wins. at this so time, down, please welcome Coach Jerry York. Jerry York to center ice, so let's listen in. As Jerry York is honored tonight's first BC BU game, he has a coach in a long, long Joining time. Coach York on the ice are his wife, Bobby, and their two children, daughter, Laura, son Brendan and his wife Lacey and their two children Colin and Elizabeth. Also joining them is William V. Campbell, Director of Athletics, Blake James and Eagle great Brian Gianta. No one in BC hockey history has accomplished more on and off the ice during his extraordinary career than Coach York. His legendary playing and coaching career sp span more than 50 years. In his final season this past spring as a Division I head coach, the 2021 Hockey East Coach of the Year retired as the all-time winningest coach in college hockey history with 1,123 career wins. His head coaching career spanned 28 years at BC, 15 years at Bowling Green, and seven years at Clarkson. In addition to bringing four NCAA championships to the Heights, Coach York led the Eagles to nine Hockey East tournament titles, guided BC to 12 Hockey East regular season championships, captured nine Beanpot victories, helped BC earn 12 Frozen Four berths, and is the all-time leader in NCAA tournament wins with 41 victories. Coach York's BC jersey was retired in 2010 during the program's national championship celebration. With Coach York, family and his love for Boston College always came first. He is a living example of the university's motto, men and women for others. Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, please direct your attention to the video boards for a very special presentation. I am unbelievably excited and proud to be uh, chosen to be the next coach at Boston College. This is a memorable day for the York family. We want to win national championships here. Eagles, the 2008 National Championship Trophy. The Boston College Eagles are the 2010 Division I champions. Boston College is on their way to their fifth title. I've always cherished my association with Boston College. Win number 925 
at the helm of his alma mater, Boston College. Jerry York's story coaching career provides a case closed result, his induction into the Hockey Hall of Fame. To come here to the Sacred Hall here and be acknowledged in the Hockey Hall of Fame, it's, it's, it's just terrific. We would now like to welcome Eagle Great and captain of the 2001 National Championship team, Brian Gianta, who has a special presentation for Coach York. Thank you, uh, Coach York. I'm honored to be a part of uh, your extended family here with your real family. But I think one of the questions everyone has for you is what is in your notebook and with your number two pencil? I think 20 years of wondering, we'd like to know what was in that notebook. On behalf of all the players that have been here before, uh, for me, my biggest thing is seeing me on to being a better person, a better person in the community, a better father to my kids. Not the player that you made me on the ice, but the person who made me off the ice. And I know a lot of other former players share that same sentiment. So on behalf of Boston College, your former players and your fans, we'd love to present you with a gold hockey stick on behalf of everyone. Congratulations. And yeah, it's heavy. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome William V. Campbell, Director of Athletics, Blake James. Jerry, it's great to have you here with us. Thank you for so many great years on behalf of the Boston College Athletic Department on the entire Boston College family and all those that have a passion for Boston College around the country. Thank you for 28 years of wonderful service. Bobby, thank you for sharing your husband for 28 years. Earlier tonight, we talked about what you're gonna do now that the golf season's over. And you said to me you wanted to do some traveling. Well, on behalf of Boston College University, we have two first class trip tickets and a hotel of your choice for a trip to Hawaii. So the two of you, go to Hawaii, have a great time. Thank you on behalf of all of us. First of all, before I thank uh, Blake for the Hawaii trip, and you have Brian Gionta here, who is a remarkable player of college hockey, uh, and five goals went inferior did against Maine, I remember that. But I'd like to uh, tell you how special this rivalry is with BUBC. And uh, my hat's off to the Czech Nation for pushing us. Uh, BC's better because of BU. BU's better because of us, and nobody else has rivals like this. Uh, you can talk about Michigan, Michigan State. You can talk about Minnesota, North Dakota. This is by far the premier rivalry in college hockey. I want to wish uh, Greg Brown and his staff the very best guiding this Boston College hockey to even better heights. And I'm just so, so excited that our fan base is, is, I think, second to none in the country. Keep coming to BC games, keep supporting them. And again, thank you very much, especially for the trip to Hawaii. Fans, let's hear it one more time for Jerry York. <laughs> 